Hello, my name is Eva Maria from PBE 6i Francis of the University and I will try to practice and interpreting. I will try to interpret the story, the end and the dove. Then I will take a note in here. So I will start it in one, two, three. The Ant and the Dove Once upon a time, a very thirsty ant was drinking water from the river. Suddenly, the ant lost his balance and fell into the river water. Help! 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 cried the ant, but no one could hear his cries. A dove, sitting on a tree nearby, saw that the ant was in trouble. She quickly plucked off a leaf from the tree and dropped it into the water. The ant climbed on the leaf he thanked the dove for saving his life. After a few days, the dove was sitting on a tree. The ant saw a hunter aiming his arrow <gasps> at the dove. The ant knew that his friend the dove was in danger. He quickly Ouch! bit the hunter's leg. The hunter cried in pain. Ouch! The hunter's arrow missed the dove. This time, the ant saved the dove. The dove thanked the ant for saving her life and they became friends forever. Moral of the story? One good deed deserves another. Okay, so that's all the video. And I have been take my notes and I have been write down the keyword in here and I will try to translate it in Indonesia. I will read the translation. Pada suatu hari, seekor semut yang sangat haus sedang meminum air di sungai. Tiba-tiba semut itu kehilangan keseimbangannya dan terjatuh ke sungai. Tolong, 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 teriak semut itu. Tapi tidak satu pun mendengar teriakannya. Seekor merpati duduk di tepi pohon, melihat semut yang sedang dalam bahaya. Dengan cepat, dia memetik daun dari pohon dan menjatuhkannya ke air. Semut itu menaiki daun, dan dia berterima kasih kepada merpati yang telah menyelamatkan hidupnya. Setelah beberapa hari, merpati sedang duduk di pohon. Semut itu melihat seorang pemburu mengarahkan anak panahnya kepada merpati. Semut itu tahu bahwa temannya merpati sedang dalam, berbahaya, dalam, sedang dalam bahaya. Dengan cepat, dia menggigit kaki si pemburu dan pemburu itu berteriak kesakitan. Panah pemburu tidak mengenai merpati. Saat inilah semut itu menyelamatkan merpati. Lalu Merpati berterima kasih kepada semut yang telah menyelamatkan hidupnya, dan mereka menjadi teman selamanya. Pesan moral dari cerita ini adalah suatu perbuatan baik akan dihargai oleh yang lainnya. So, that's all the translation from the story, the end and the dove. And if there are any mistake, please forgive me and thank you.